Bum bum. Bum bum. Never mind, apparently he only did one. Ah, uh, no, don't, don't look at Tien. Don't look at Tien. Can't see him for another three years. If I see him before those three years are up, then the world is going to explode. I am planning to play Mystery Dungeon tomorrow, yes. That is the plan. Mine. Thank you. Alright, where's my last Dragon Ball? Oh, it's in West City. The Royal comes out on Tuesday, not Monday. So that's, uh, today's Friday, so Saturday, Sunday, Monday is like three days. I'm definitely gonna do a five-hour stream on Tuesday. And probably Wednesday. And probably Thursday. And most likely Friday. Maybe Saturday. Probably Sunday as well. Oh my goodness. I cannot wait. We have a side quest to do here as well. Aw, oh, it's not at the, the lighthouse like it normally is, Rip. Oh, it's all the way over there. Why must you make me go so far? It is that easy. I'm looking at chat, so I ran into a mountain. Whatever. Goku's head is hard. It's probably fun. Kes says five instead of six, despite me. Five hours is better this for me, personally. City, still pretty big. But I do like to spite people, yeah. Well, th that was highly unnecessary to break that tree, Gohan, but whatever. Okay. Let's summon a dragon. We haven't unlocked any other people to revive. I really want Captain Ginyu, but whatever. Uh, I, we'll just do Dodoria, then Zarbon. It doesn't really matter. Whoops. Shinron! Will the timing for your students be different when you do five hours? No, I'll still start at four or two CST like I usually do. Four if it's a weekday, two if it's a weekend. I'm going to start skipping this, actually, because we've seen it enough. Like, I don't, I don't need to see this for the fifth time. All right. I don't really care to go straight to Dodoria. Let's go do the side quest that is in, uh, that was in West City and knock that out. Probably by the time we do these three side quests, because we should have three of them right now, the Dragon Balls will respawn, and we can wish Zarbon back, and we'll be done with wishing villains back for at least a little while. I can see myself getting lost in a city this year. You can fly. I doubt you'd get lost. Do I have to, I have to go into Capsule Corp? Oh, I bet Dr. Briefs is inside Capsule Corp, yeah. That makes sense. They should have put a very thin shadow of Cell in the background of this image. That might be a good idea indeed. What's up, Dr. Briefs? Does Oolong live here now? Hey there! Hi, Goku. Do you have a minute? Yo! Hell, what's up? Hey. Dr. Briefs' voice does not match him at all in my mind. I need to go back and watch the original dub and see what I think he sounded like. An idea for a new machine just hit me like a meteor. Problem is, I don't have the materials for it. A machine? What kind of machine? One that'll whip up some grub in a flash? No, no, no. No, no. One that goes bzz, clank when it moves. I hate this. Bzz, clank? Yeah, I don't know what that means. Ah, hmm? oh, well, you see, its drive system will be powered by hydraulics, which no. is where... Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm not looking for a science lesson. I just want food. <laughs> All I need to know is that you're looking to build some complicated no, machine. No, no. Well, it'll be quite simple to build, but I need some special materials what to make it stronger. Think? Would you mind gathering the materials for me? I'll return the favor. Let's do it. Easy going genius. Gotcha. Sure, I can do that, I guess. Thank you. Thanks, I owe you one. Here's what I'll need. That should be everything. Oh, but Densite might give you some trouble. You won't find it just lying around. It's a rather special type of mineral. You'll only be able to find it by breaking large boulders. 
So I just need to blow up some big rocks, huh? No problem. All right, I'm off. Yeah, Cell originally didn't even exist. Originally, the villains of the Android Saga were supposed to be Android 19 and 20. But then one of Toriyama... I think it was... Uh, I always forget exactly how this goes. I think it's one of Toriyama's editors said it can't be this old dude to do it. Like, his current editor said that. It's like, these villains suck. Make better ones. And then he made 17 and 18, and maybe also 16, but he made 17 and 18. And then I think his previous editor, he talked to him, and his previous editor said, like, this is ridiculous that these little kids are the villains. So then he made Cell's first form, and after he showed, I think he showed that one to his current editor, and his current editor said, this looks stupid, get him to another form, like, immediately. And after Toriyama made the second form, he was like, please get him to his final form faster, this looks awful. And then he got him to his final form. Like, that's why the second form didn't last long. It was all a lot of stuff. Wait, wait, where do I need to go for this stuff? Does the game tell me, like, where to go to get this? Story progress. No, it just says... Okay, wait a minute. No. Uh, Dr. Briefs. Where do I find these things? Whoops. Bye. Count on you for those materials. Dense time will give you some trouble. You'll only be able to find it by breaking large boulders. You see any strange ones, break apart. Silver ore in the rocky cliffs. Okay, I've already got the silver ore. Don't know where to go? The map will show you where to find the good stuff. No, but I don't need to know that. I need to know how to get the other two things. I've already got that one. Wait, what did Bulma just say? Oh, dang it. Well, I'm just getting screwed over at every turn here, huh? I don't, like, I don't know where to go to get these materials. I hate the fetch quests in this game. Hate it. You need to turn your voice down. Got to turn the volume up when you're not talking. I haven't had any other complaints, and it sounded fine to me when I listened back to the videos. I think it may just be you. Are these waypoints showing me where to get things, or are they showing me other side quests? I hope they're showing me where to get things. Finally think I know stuff, but then Chaos pulls out a draw for Mega Uno reverse card on me. <laughs> I actually, uh, I rewatched a lot of DBZ not long ago, because like I said, my boy Michael, he watched the series for the first time, so I was reading a lot of stuff about Dragon Ball Z as a result of that. So, I ended up looking up a lot of articles with stuff like that about interviews and stuff Toriyama did. Oh, hey. Intruder detected. Must eliminate. <laughs> I just need to beat these things, huh? Let's go. This thing is level 39, I've just realized. I'm about to get shot. Yeah, I got shot. Yeah, please end it, Piccolo. You know what? I'm just gonna throw out the spirit bomb. Don't mind me. These things are totally worth the spirit bomb. They're giant threats. I don't have any key, I've just realized. Oh no. Charge up, charge up, charge up. Nice. Nope. You know what? These are the greatest threats I've ever faced. I'm gonna need some Super Saiyan power up in here. It's the only way. What does being Super Saiyan do? Does it just mean I do more damage? Is that about what it is? That's what I would expect. Ow. I should not have been hit there. I dodged out of it, but then I pressed circle to punch the enemy, and it moved me back. Something in my throat. Back into the attack. Very not okay with how that went. Oh, they're all dead. Nice. Skull Robo gear. Kes's voice is a lot louder than this game's audio usually. I don't agree with that. My voice is definitely, like, a bit louder because, you know, it would be really lame if you couldn't hear my voice well over the game's, like, background music. I wouldn't say it's a lot louder. My balance is normally pretty good, in my opinion. I mean, like, I've watched back plenty of these DBZ videos when titling them and whatnot. They all sound fine to me. Alright, what's going on over here? 
This is where I need to blow up a giant rock. Do I need to blow up this rock? I'll blow up this rock. Don't think I won't. Blew it up. Hey. You uh got any densite in there? Oh, there it is. My densite. Alright, this fetch quest was not nearly as bad as the turtle one. Gears are one thing, but I don't think stones would be this hard to find. Better head back to Dr. Briefs. Let's get it. I'm just going to fly there because, I mean, it, it's right over here. Actually, no, I can fast travel straight into Capsicorp, can I? No, stop. Go go up. I was pressing R2 instead of R1. Capsicorp. Don't let the environmentalists know about the Saiyans. Yeah, don't let the environmentalists know about the guys who literally blow up planets. You don't have to save the environment if you just get rid of the environment, you know? Saves a lot of trouble. Here you go, old timer. I like your Thank mustache. You. Well done, now leave the rest to science. Yep. Get Senku up in here. Now I'll be able to finish something extra nice. <laughs> oh, what kind of machine are you trying to make? What kind? Well, it's a super music machine. Music machine? Indeed, I've designed it to produce three-dimensional music and even dance to it. But what does three-dimensional music mean? I was struggling with its rhythmic synchronization, but with these materials, I'll finally be able to. Okay, okay, I'm good. Yo, I agree with Goku here. Are you sure? <sighs> I was kind of hoping you'd make something cooler, like a vehicle. Yeah, can you make me a motorbike? Because, you know, Goku needs to be hip and popular with the kids again. So there's no better way to do that than, like, put him on a motorbike. That would have been too easy. I'm trying to sketch my stretch, even. My creative muscles, so to speak. Oh, okay. Honestly, I'm not really sure what you're talking about. Well, just know that because of you, I'm one step closer to completion. Thanks a bunch. Give me your soul emblem. Give me your soul. Just straight up. Let's go. I took his soul. It's mine. Oh, level 9 mechanic, level 8 pervert. Who could have guessed? Bulma's dad is making the PS5. Now we're talking. All right, where did where did they put the Doria at? Wait a minute, where do I not have other side quests to do? I don't see them on the map. I have to go to King Kai's planet. Also, no, I don't see uh, the Doria. Maybe I can't do it right now because it's like where I am in the story. I'll have to wait until later, I guess. Oh, didn't they say you can only do it in intermissions? I think they did, didn't they? So, well, that's fine. It'll be waiting for us when we get to the intermission. Whatever. Uh, so I gotta get to King Kai's planet. I'm trying to keep up with chat. A lot of stuff is going on in chat. How do I go to... Oh, off Earth area. There's a button for it. Ah, King Kai's planet. Guess I'm gonna go there. Away we go. Sup, Bubbles. Hey, you're the only character I respect. Hey, Bubbles, how's it going? Ooh. Huh? You seem kind of down. I got you. Give me your monkey soul. He's bummed about bananas. Yo. You okay? If there's anything I can do to help, let me know. Ooh. Yeah, I have no idea what's bothering you. Hello. I'm gonna have to summon Shenron to ask to translate. Ah, oh, Goku, I'm glad you're here. I think Bubbles might be hungry. Would you mind getting him some fruit or something? <laughs> ah, so that's it. You're hungry, Bubbles. Ooh. Right, he gobbled up all the fruit on this planet. Now he's depressed there's none left. I'll get him some, but what kind of fruit should I get, Goku, please? Yep. Bubbles only eats premium fruit. He's a connoisseur of the finer things, like me. Really? But your food's not that good. Yeah. How dare you! If you think you know so much about food, then prove it. Bring me something tasty. All right. Okay, I'll bring Bubbles some fruit and you one of Chi-Chi's boxed lunches. Those are delicious. <sighs> For your sake, I hope they are. So what kind of fruit should I bring Bubbles? Goku, please. <sighs> Let's see. It's going to have to be cosmic bananas. They're the sweetest fruit in the galaxy. All right. Got it. I'll go get some. Hang tight, Bubbles. You'll be feasting on some sweet fruit in no time. <laughs> huh? Wait, I've never seen that fruit before. Or even heard of it. Can I find it on Earth? Yep. Well, you should be able to. I heard its seeds were brought to Earth ages ago. I wonder where I can find it, then. <laughs> Wait, I bet Bulma knows something. 
hang on, Bubbles, I'll get your fruit. Yo, Goku, what if you instant transmit and she's, like, in the shower? I don't think Goku thinks before he uses instant transmission. Then again, I don't think Goku thinks very often. When he does, he does things like throwing his son at Cell, which almost didn't work. Hey, Bulma. Your your hair still looks awful. Hi there. Oh, hi, Goku. What's up? Sorry to ask this. Yeah, I need to ask you something. Right. I think I know. I think I might know where to find some. <laughs> Oh, yeah? Actually... But that fruit only grows deep in the heart of the jungle, making it extremely expensive. Who are you getting it for again? A monkey. <laughs> Bubbles. Bubbles? Like the Powerpuff Girl? King Kai's pet? What? Wait, you mean you're giving fruit that decadent to someone's pet? Yeah. Well, King Kai said that's the only thing he'll eat. Like King Kai himself, he's a real pain sometimes. Hey! Hey, I heard that, Goku. Uh -oh. Wait, were you listening this whole time, King Kai? King Kai, you just listen to Goku's, like, conversations all the time? What if, what if he was taking a shower or, like, getting it on with Chi-Chi and you just butted in like, hey, Goku, you, this is a bad time? So, Bulma, how much is this fruit going to set me back exactly? Mm. Well, shops don't always carry it, but when they do, it's about 10 million zenny or so. Oh, no way! It's that expensive? So what do you want to do, King Kai? You got 10,000 zenny? Or 10 million, rather? Huh? King Kai? Of all the times to give me the silent treatment, he cut the line. <laughs> Oh, well, guess I'll have to head to the jungle and get it myself. Think you can point me in the right direction, Bulma? <sighs> you know, you guys are always hunting or picking your own food. Don't you ever think of earning some money and buying things for a change? Yeah, easy for you to say. You were born to the richest man on the planet. That being said, you've definitely earned your money as well because you're a freaking genius. Goku and Bulma continue their search for the Dragon Balls. The two are able... I totally forgot that Oolong used to wear that outfit. The two are able to get de the deceptive shapeshifter Oolong to join them, but he proves to be a flight risk. In order to entice him to stay, Bulma offers him some candy, which Oolong is more than happy to taste. It is actually a special candy of Bulma's creation. Uttering the word piggy causes the ingester to experience an instant bowel movement. Uh, original Dragon Ball is, at times, the dumbest thing I've ever seen. Bulma takes advantage of the effect, which lasts a month, to prevent Oolong from ever thinking of running away. Hmm. Can I eat this? this? Yeah, I think I'll get sick if I eat it. <laughs> when has that ever stopped you before? All right. all right, all right, all right. This must be the jungle that we need to go to. In Super, that did happen. He transported into her and Vegeta's bedroom when she was coming out of the shower. That's just dumb. <laughs> Original Dragon Ball is a fever dream. It really kind of is, isn't it? Super tasty bananas. Super tasty. All right. This is the spot Bulma told right. me about. Let's find some bananas. Where are my bananas at? I assume they're up in the trees? But hey, what do I know? Are they on the marker? No, they're not. Yeah. Surely they're like in the trees. You would think. Probably. Maybe? I don't know. Bananas grow in trees. Yeah. I think. I'm gonna be real with you. I don't think I've ever seen a growing banana. Now that I think about it, this is such a strange thing to realize about myself. I've never seen a banana on a tree. I just assume they, they grow on trees. Are they on these smaller trees? Chad, do bananas grow on trees? Apparently not. They're on the ground right here, it looks like. You're, you're really about to make me pick up one banana at a time for ten bananas? Like, I wouldn't mind if it was like four bananas max, but ten bananas I gotta be picking up? Like, are you are you kidding me right now? That's a little much video game. Goku, you got your yard rat pants all wet. What are you doing? They don't grow on trees, they spawn on the ground. Bananas grow on bushes? Do they really? I'm gonna have to Google it, because this is exactly the kind of question that, like, everyone in chat would be like, haha, what if we make Chaos think that bananas grow like this when they really don't? 
I've actually never, I cannot think of a time in my life where I've seen a growing banana. That's crazy. I'm pretty sure they just grow on trees. 